Number 120. Tim received a 20% good student discount on his car insurance policy, followed by a 10% discount as a safe driver. What is the overall percent change of the price of his car insurance bill? If you're thinking about adding 20% and 10% to give you an answer of 30%, that won't work if they price the policy with the 20% discount first and then a 10% discount right after. The only way that will work if they just apply the 30% all at once. But if they apply it in sequence, C won't be the right answer. So the keyword here is followed by. So we got to take this problem one step at a time. So for this question, we can pick any price for the original price of the car insurance bill. So let's pick a number. Let's say the original price is 300. If you pick 200 or 500, it won't change your answer for this type of problem. So he receives a 20% discount. So let's put a negative sign to that. So this is a 1 minus R situation. 20% is 0.20. 1 minus 0.20 is 0.80. So to get the new price, we need to multiply 300 by 0.80. So after the first 20% discount, his car insurance bill will be 240. Now, if we apply a 10% discount, this is another 1 minus R situation. 10% is 0.10. 1 minus 0 0.10 is 0.90. So we got to multiply 240 by 0.90. And that will be 216. So applying another 10% discount on the 240 will reduce the bill to 216. So now we can calculate the overall percent change. Using the formula, the new price minus the original price divided by the original times 100%. The new price is 216 relative to the original price which we selected of 300. So 216 minus 300 divided by 300 times 100%. 216 minus 300 that gives us a change of negative $84. Divide that by 300 times 100%. The overall percent change is negative 28. It's less than 30. So B is going to be the correct answer choice.